Good morning, church family. Today is April the 1st, April Fool's Day. My name is Bill Holbrook, and today's subject is about respect. So I find it only appropriate to start with this. Okay, enough of that. I'm sure many of you could see that one coming. All right, as Christians, we should all have the desire to be more like Christ. All of us are, uh, are sinners. We all have our own desires, ambitions, dislikes, and, and likes. Uh, as Christians, we should all be mindful that we are always showing others an example. Sometimes it's a good one, sometimes it's a poor one. But I dare say that all of us fall short of what Christ expects of us. Maybe it's a vulgar joke that we repeat at work. Maybe it's a derogatory comment made about someone. Or maybe it's repeating unproven accusations about someone or gossip, as we all refer to it. We should always be looking for ways to display respect for those around us, whether it be your family members, be church members, someone at Walmart that makes you upset that they're taking too long on the line. In the book of Matthew, chapter 25, verse 40, Christ tells us, I tell you the truth, whatever you did for one of, the, uh, one of the least of these, my brothers, you did for me. So any good deed you do for someone, you're doing that for Christ. Likewise, in Matthew 25, verse 45, Jesus also tells us, I tell you the truth, whatever you did not do for one of the least of these, you did not do for me. That's a sobering thought. Respect is something that is sometimes hard to give, but it is something that is expected of all of us as disciples of Christ. Let's try to make sure that we incorporate this in our lifestyle, not just today, not just the rest of this month, but let's try to make this a habit that we show respect to those around us. Thank you and have a good day.